Let's get the video started, shall we? Hi guys! <laughs> Hi guys, so, hair bow. Hi guys, so in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to get boys to like you. I'm 19 now, so maybe I should start saying men. Nope, they're boys. I think that I've actually done this video before, but this time, I'm much older, much wiser, so it's better. Mmm, that's good. It's real good. I think that us, as human beings, we try to mentally prepare ourselves for a positive or a negative outcome, and that isn't always a good thing because a lot of times it is your embarrassing moments, the ones that stick with you and scar you forever, that really just stick with you and change you in the most positive way that they possibly could. I think that that is majority true and is a majority of true, is of a majority. I think that that and out of the majority, I think that that is... <laughs> what am I saying? Pretty much, that applies mostly with relationships. There we go. I got it out. Instead of sitting around torching yourself, like trying to figure out the best way to go talk to that person, just go talk to him or her. And honestly, there is a good chance that you're going to get to know that person and their personality. And maybe you won't even like them anymore. Huh? Huh? Do not in a million years worry about coming on too strong to someone. Damn it, if you are the kind of person that goes in too strong, you go in strong, you know what I'm saying? Don't try to pretend like you aren't that way to please the person you're trying to get the attention of. I know, it is natural instinct to do that, but you're defeating the purpose of getting them to like you because they're not gonna like you, they're gonna like what who you are pretending to be. So you be you, girl or guy. At some point you might meet someone who only likes it if people come on to them too strong because if you're not coming on too strong, a lot of times people are gonna see that as like, whoa, are they like even interested in me at all? Or like, do I have to keep pushing really hard? Am I gonna come on too strong? Both humans, your equivalent, your mindsets are like, right here. One person isn't superior to the other. The only thing that intimidates us as people is that we are not inside of the other person's heads. We don't know what they're thinking. We don't know what's going on in their lives either unless we go talk to them. So just go talk to them. I'm getting a little worked up over this and I was not expecting that. Normally whenever you meet someone that you are really going to be a good fit with and they're going to be a good fit with you, they will not see what you're doing to them as coming on too strong and vice versa you won't see that with them and they probably worry about coming on too strong too whenever they really like someone but if you both really like each other and everything meshes really well you are not going to come on too strong because you're going to want that person to come on super strong because you want to know 100,000 a million percent that they're interested in you guys and girls both are very comparative with the same sex like if I have uh, three jelly rolls, I am going to compare myself to a girl that has two jelly rolls. Why? Why do I do that? If you really do like a person, or if a person really likes you, I promise, a million times, I promise, that they do not care if you have jelly rolls. Truthfully, if that person that you like is superficial enough to judge you because of anything on your body, like before they know you and they love you for who you are on the inside, they are probably not ready for any kind of a serious relationship at all. I really am getting so worked up. There is not one human being that is perfect, so, Stop with the whole comparing yourself to somebody else's Instagram feed. They're not gonna post on Instagram their insecurities unless they're doing some kind of insecurity challenge. But other than that, they are not gonna post their insecurities for other people to know what their weak spot is. And one final tip, if you really want to catch someone's heart, all you have to do is this. So I hope that helps you guys land a mate. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful Friday and I will see you guys next Friday with a new video.